kusikia kuna vitu watu walikunywa kuchangamsha asubuhi. I'd like to believe ni chai moto lakini si ya kuchoma ulimi. How do you like your tea by the way? Black, no sugar, with milk, creamy. Kuniambia ama upendi chai kabisa. At white five on Facebook, at white five four channel on Twitter hashtag is why in the morning. So good Monday morning, and we're about to finish it off uh, with man crush. So to quote me, pose a question on the Facebook. You can just uh, end up to slide to code. Just make your way to our social media platforms that I've just mentioned, or you can find them somewhere below your screen and answer the question we are asking today. The topic is a little okay but i'd like to think they're all sensitive but today the topic is dating single moms dating single moms do like you as we introduce our guests sasini hey tabi dimme smile lucky hi hi yeah that's better to answer up as a salary on a smart thank you linda shopping i'm gonna put a four way 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 we are not used how are you i'm very fine what put up Sijapotea niko tu ni kukuwa busy ki, kiasi tu. Wea sorry governor. Wana kuita nani? <laughs> I'm Calvin Sasano. Mm -hmm. A student of the University of Nairobi. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I'm Calvin Sosano on all my social media pages. Mm -hmm. So you can find me on Instagram, Twitter and mm -hmm. Facebook mm -hmm. uh, by that name. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Asi wapime ya tijeni mpole. Yes, simple. Shanza kuongea, atararua. Maybe we can have the gentleman over here. Is this your first time? Yes, my first time. Karibu sana. Uku tunaongeaga. Eh, you're not even ready. I'm Wana good in talking. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, you're sure? Yeah. Because I'll give you a practical just in a few minutes. What's your name? My name is Boniface Kilonzo Mok. Mm -hmm. I'm a student at the University of Nairobi. Mm -hmm. Taking journalism mm -hmm. and practically more on radio production. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're quite well dressed for a radio person who's in radio. Ama atanyi mkaga tu po hao. Ni vile tuwa tuwa honi? Yeah, unajua ni sauti tu peki yagi. Okay. So, let me see you. All right, karibu sana kwa ito. Hi, Queen. Hi, my name is Mary. Mm-hmm. Mary Ojan. Mm-hmm. I'm a mom, a life coach, a mentor, a politician. Mm-hmm. And basically, I'm awaiting my first graduation from the University of Nairobi. First, there are more to come. Yes. You're a superwoman. Of course. I see you. <laughs> what does being a life coach mean? Uh, basically, is uh, seeing other girls, my area of interest is young girls, mm -hmm. seeing other girls grow through the challenges of life mm -hmm. and being the better they mm -hmm. need to be, bringing out the best in every woman in each capacity of their life. I want to high five you, but you're so far from me. I'll high five you soon after this. Karibuni sana. Maybe I should start with. Hmm. Can I start with you, Queen? Is that alright? Sure. Today we're talking about dating single moms. Have. Maybe I should ask. Where is the person who made you a mom? Are you still together? <laughs> no, 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 no. You're not together. No. Do you find it hard to meet other people, see other people when you have a baby? Okay. You see, being a mother is kind of an additional responsibility. Mm -hmm. And it opens your thinking, your mind in every aspect of mm -hmm. life. Mm -hmm. And that doesn't limit you mm -hmm. from continuing with your life because one person mm -hmm. maybe messed up your life or maybe one person walked out of your life. Mm -hmm. And it's actually a, a good thing that we women mm -hmm. choose to prioritize and mm -hmm. take responsibility mm -hmm. of every single child we bear mm -hmm. because most of these young moms if i have to say speaking on behalf of other young moms mm -hmm. most of them it's not their wish mm -hmm. to have their children alone mm -hmm. it's the failure of these men who mm -hmm. get them pregnant because i didn't get myself pregnant you didn't have pregnant thoughts saki <laughs> imagine to mimba, mimba, but then exactly. suddenly no, that did not happen. Somebody got me pregnant. Mm -hmm. Somebody got that girl outside there pregnant. Mm -hmm. And they are not responsible. And we have to celebrate these moms mm -hmm. because they took up the responsibility of taking care of these children mm -hmm. and making them the persons they want to be. Mm -hmm. So today let's also start by celebrating moms. Mm -hmm. Yes. And I like that. Can we just take a moment to celebrate single moms out there? Yeah, we celebrate you. But <laughs> Uh, and anakuja from a perspective that manze wanaume but mm. i disagree with that for some how can you say that you got someone got you it was you had a wish there was a decision with the man that i want to be pregnant or not you had that decision it can't so, have been oops 
Huh? You, it can't have been an oops type of situation. No, it can't be a mistake. Hmm. She decided I want to be pregnant. Uh -huh. She had that choice of making, I'm not going to be pregnant, yes or not. Okay. So, uh, whether it comes, <sighs> yeah, 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 okay. Let mm. me dis uh, uh, disrupt him Please. a little bit. Mm -hmm. You see, when you say you make decisions, you know, I think from the way you're speaking, you're kind of naive. You're not exposed, mm -hmm. and you really don't know what real life issues is. I guess maybe you might be a virgin, so you really don't know what consent is, because not all women who get pregnant <laughs> have consent. <laughs> Mike <laughs> well, shots so, have been fired. <laughs> uh -huh. So you can't blame uh, moms for taking response. Some of them were not consensual. Mm -hmm. Actually, three quarters of them were not consensual. I'm really glad you brought that up because there, there are several ways a, a mom can be a single mom. You know, either a kona member, a nania kamruka, a makona member bona kekafa. You know, and I'm or sometimes they tell you about. Mm -hmm. And it's the responsibility of me as a person, mm -hmm. as a human being, to mm -hmm. know that the life I'm carrying in my stomach mm -hmm. needs another chance. Mm -hmm. So men, most men, mm -hmm. boys, let me call them boys because men don't do that. Mm -hmm. Most boys have opted for immaturity mm -hmm. to tell girls when they get them pregnant mm -hmm. to abort. And these boys are in the age of, let's say, 15 mm -hmm. and 27. Mm -hmm. Most of them don't take responsibility of impregnating girls. Mm. And they leave, they leave girls with no other options of either aborting mm -hmm. or they dump them. Mm -hmm. Or few responsible moms like me mm -hmm. will take up the challenge and take care of this life and mm -hmm. bring it forth and even take care of these children. Brother Apoko Pagomo, gentlemen, you are somewhere between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> no, I, think, I, I think I, I, I agree with her mm -hmm. to some extent. Mm -hmm. There are some men that do not want to take responsibility, mm -hmm. that they get a lady pregnant and jump out of the relationship, mm -hmm. or, or they tell the lady to abort the kid. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's, it's right to some extent. Mm -hmm. And uh, this thing, sometimes it's, it's a mistake. But also, I have to blame the ladies too, mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. you went to the relationship mm -hmm. before going to a, into a relationship. You should be sure. It's not something you jump into People and start lie, and start sleeping with them. Mm -hmm. It's not something. It's something you should first know the the guy mm -hmm. so very well before starting dating him, because some guy. But I know some guys change with the time as long as Asha Kupea Ball she'll he'll just jump out of the relationship. Mm -hmm. And I support all, I also support you in the idea of celebrating single women. They really work hard, they're very courageous. Mm -hmm. They're very courageous. They've taken the responsibility of a father and a mother. A responsibility of a, a father and a mom. I have a question for you. Yeah. Would you date a lady if you knew she was a single mom? A lady, if I knew she was mm. single, <laughs> I would. I would. You would. You wouldn't would be afraid of the responsibility that comes with loving her child. Yeah, I want to be. I want to be afraid. Mm -hmm. You know, it's a step. As long as there's love, at least. Kama ni shampenda, kama ni mempenda, it will be good. Mm -hmm. As long as I nampenda, I'll take the responsibility. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's do this. Let's get into the slides right now so we can ask a couple of questions. We've been thinking of asking you uh, at White Five on Facebook, at White Five Four channel, Twitter hashtag is Why in the Morning. So dating single moms, dating single moms. What is the stigma around single moms? As in, unawabeba, Jin. That's a very important question. What is the stigma around single moms? Unawabeba, Ajin. Unawabeba, Ajin. Single women. Can I give you an example? Yeah. I had a conversation with a, a young gentleman not too long ago. And he told me, according to him, he feels single moms are, are very... They have wakona mzigo. Yeah, ko punguza mzigo initiative. As in, when you date a single mom, that means already you have pressures for, oh, she has a child, or akikona tu hivya nanza kutuma pampas kidokidogo. Is that the kind of thing that you feel? I know. Going into jumping into a relationship of dating a single woman is not like any other relationship. A single one who has a child, a yeah, single who mom. Yeah, who has a child. Mm -hmm. Seek to, seek to, 
kama hizo relationship zingine not something you just wake up one day and say i'm going to date a single lady today mm. it's something you should be prepared for mm -hmm. as long as you're going to date a single lady that mm -hmm. has a has kids or a kid mm -hmm. you should be ready for the responsibility mm. yeah it's not something easy but you should it's your own decision ni decision unafa ku make mwenyewe mwenyewe si ati kwa pressure ready. jukuna some people mm -hmm. they just uh, say they will want to date single la single ladies who have kids when they get get into the relationship atanza sasa kuona like it's a burden to him mm -hmm. yeah the family starts becoming a burden to him the kids anaona hai au watoto sio wangu the love that she he should have gotten from the lady mm -hmm. herself he, he oh. is sharing with the kids who are not oh, yeah that would be a problem like yeah, uh, una spend problem. more time na mtoi than yeah. me there are instances of jealousy in that in that mm. relationship <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to help you now. Yeah. Really then a woman who, who is nini, who is single who has a kid. Mm -hmm. The first priority of this lady will always be our kids, mm -hmm. not you. Our kids will always come first. I assure you. Our and kids, you're comfortable with that. Yeah. So you should be ready. Me atuka kuniambia una. Na usiogope. Okay. There's no right or wrong answer here. Yeah. Mhm. Una beba je. What what do you imagine when when you think of dating a single mom? Hey, dating a single mom is something that you need to decide first. It's not something simple that you just get in jump okay, in that. Okay, uh, before you continue, why mm. don't we give respect to all women, whether they are single mothers or not? Mbona of course we do. Of course we do. Na hii ingine unaingia tu kicheza games ako kama umetoka. Of course we do. Myself, I've been raised by a single mom mm -hmm. since, unfortunately, my father died. I'm and sorry. for me, I take her like a father and a mother at one time. Mm -hmm. Because all that I know, it's because of at the far I am at the university. All everything she has done it by herself. Mm -hmm. Now, if you talk of dating, mm -hmm. so dating someone like that, it will be very hard for you. Honestly, it will be very hard. Mm -hmm. Because first, mom, prior we we an atuweka system like that. Me, me, my my sister and my young brother. Once I make sure we are okay with everything, mm -hmm. you have created maybe dating. I have seen some men try dating her, but she has never. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's not something similar. W would you allow, let's give you a girlfriend. Her mm. name is Stacy. You've been seeing Stacy off and on now <coughs> for a while. Then, I don't know, for whatever reason that happened, maybe you guys broke up. Are you going to go back to Stacy because, you know, now you have a child and you have to live and love each other for the rest of your lives. Ama utakubali tu yaliisha, that it's just not going to happen for you guys and be part of the child's life. What do you do? Unfortunately, I'm, I will not go back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so you're now giving a child another opportunity to be raised by a single mother. But it, would, it was not mine. Mm -hmm. No, it's yours. Oh, it's mine. Yeah. If it's mine, I'll take care of it. Mm -hmm. 100% it am chukua ni mfanye kila kitu like a father I do. Really? Yeah. Now where's the No, no, no. I can't. I can't. Mm -hmm. I can't. So far, I've seen how 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 raising. Okay. A, a, Let me a give you alone. a quick tutorial. Utashikilia pa katikati kama pasta alafu semeje. Semeje? Yeah. Yeah. We will continue just like that. Mm -hmm. So you are talking of me raising my own child. Mm -hmm. That I will do obvious. I will do with all my heart, with everything, mm -hmm. because I did it myself. I I see for you to move in. Yeah. I will take care. Because I have seen it how, how it takes to to kulea mtoto. Siki to musiki to raise. Umeonea wapi? See, I have seen my mother struggle with us kutulea. Kweli? Of course. Like when he first seen. born? Yes, I, I want first to imagine. <laughs> so what's what's the age of the last one in your family? She is... Um, Ulipata wa kingwe ama... No, he ah. was born while I was there. Like, uh -huh. He is in class 7, I'm not sure the age, please. <laughs> It's okay. Queen. Oh, but tell me what you think from the conversations I've just had here. Okay. Uh, Do you think there's truth to it? <laughs> no. Tell me. First, let me start by the way uh, single moms mm -hmm. have been victimized. Mm -hmm. In uh, a cultural context, when you go to the villages, mm -hmm. you'll hear people saying, 
for example, when I was expecting, mm -hmm. people were praying. People who really even don't know about the father of the child and my whereabouts, mm -hmm. that it should be a girl. Uh, because yeah. if it's a son, nobody mm -hmm. will want to marry me. Uh, yeah. Ati? Yes, that, those are the kind of stereotypes people have. Uh -huh. If it's a son, uh -huh. maybe the, the next man who will want to marry me will have issues of inheritance and all that issues. And everybody, Being including African, maybe my mom, maybe yeah. one of her prayer was that I give birth to a girl. Uh -huh. I, personally, I, I, I didn't choose. Uh -huh. I was like, whichever come, and I even have both girls and boys' name when I was expecting wow. few days to my mm -hmm. uh, my Did delivery. Mm -hmm. So there is a way society has set in their mind that mm -hmm. it's wrong for a woman to give birth to a son mm -hmm. out of wedlock. Mm -hmm. And in fact, we've been further criminalized as sinners. Mm -hmm. When you are a girl, you are not married Kwanza and you are pregnant. Kapsa, mm, you are just loose. Just you go are loose, talking you are to all the men. In mm -hmm. fact, even churches can excommunicate you and call you to explain. I was called to explain are why. Are you serious? Huh? You're giving me goosebumps. So oh, now <laughs> mungine part two wa, wa conjunction. Where was he? Was he also being called to explain? No, no, no. No, in the picture. Of course, we don't come from the same religious background. Mm -hmm. So for my church, it was actually wrong that I, went, I got a child out of wedlock. Mm -hmm. And that raises the question, should we keep on pushing young girls who get pregnant out of wedlock to abortions? Because this, these stereotypes is the reason why we have many infants being killed. Mm -hmm. So there is a problem that needs to be addressed. Mm -hmm. First, the way people think. Mm -hmm. Let them change. It's not wrong for a girl to be pregnant. Mm -hmm. It's a blessing. Even mm -hmm. the Bible says a child is a blessing. Mm -hmm. And these children, for a fact, my daughter is a blessing to me. Oh, because it's the girl. reason for me to live. Mm -hmm. It's the reason for me to wake up every morning to go and get some food on the table. Mm -hmm. It's the reason for me to work and get money for her school fee. Mm -hmm. And her brightness, mm -hmm. her bright face and everything about her, the beauty and everything, is the reason why I work every time mm -hmm. to ensure she's well, her well-being is well taken care of. Mm -hmm. So the way people stereotype these young mothers, it's not really right. And worst of it all when it comes to the, I've been dating before. Mm -hmm. uh, at one point when I was dating, mm -hmm. there was that question of you could feel it mm -hmm. that this guy is not really uh, welcoming the child in this relationship. Mm -hmm. And I can tell young moms outside there, if you are dating somebody, first tell him about who you are. Akuna could surprise. The surprise! <laughs> Kwa wili. No. Ana kuita sleep over mana kuja wa wili. <laughs> no, 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 no. I tell you in advance, I am a mom mm -hmm. to a beautiful girl. Mm -hmm. So at no point mm -hmm. will I ever neglect my child because of the so-called love. Mm -hmm. My first love is my daughter. So what Take said it was or true. leave it. Mm -hmm. okay. What I said it. Eh. What I said. Oui. If you want to date a single mom, mm -hmm. you should prepare. Mm -hmm. Because she will never consider you before a kid. Mm -hmm. A kid will always be her first priority. Mm -hmm. So you should first get that into your head mm -hmm. before start jumping into a relationship of dating a single mom. And also, like she said, it's people's mentality. Mm -hmm. Africans, if you give birth to a son and you'll be get, getting married to a certain community, mm -hmm. it's, like they, it's like they don't want guys who because the guys mm -hmm. inherit property mm -hmm. so for instance i get i am my mom is married with me mm -hmm. she had me when she she had me before getting my dad mm -hmm. so when i am um, when she gets married to my dad the family of my dad's place will take will have a very difficult time accepting me. It's very difficult. Mm -hmm. And also, to, I have some little experience of a guy mm -hmm. who a, a certain man got married to a certain single ma woman mm -hmm. who had a son. Now, we mbaba akam somesha vizuri at the university. Mm -hmm. Akafanya kamaliza kazi, akapata akamaliza shule, mm -hmm. akapata kazi. Then after getting a job, after getting a job, mm -hmm. instead of helping the, <laughs> the father who raised him, he went back to look for his real dad. He went back to help his real dad instead of the father that raised him. So that's also, that's 
some of the instances discouraging people who want to date mm. young women. Mm. Imagine she went, he went mm -hmm. back to, to look for his real dad, his biological Aww. dad, after the other one raised him and educated him, all those sort of things. Mm -hmm. Alirudia kasanza kusaidia the biological dad and living abandoning the father who raised him. So that's some of the things discouraging us as men of dating with single women. What was that? But honestly, what's wrong with uh, a child going to help? Yes. It's the same way you can wake <laughs> up. How can you abandon someone who raised Did you? Did he abandon the family? Yeah, he abandoned some, the, the father who took care of him from childhood. Akakwa mkubwa, akamweducate, akapata job. I he abandoned him and went I to the biological father. I think abandoning, mm. you expected this child because amelimishwa, mm. anafaa kuchukua all his attention to direct to the family that raised him. But it's not wrong. It, you want to help every other person in the no, community. No, he abandoned. He didn't help his... Aliacha biological father, but the father who raised him. The father who raised him always, oh, alikuwa na sema kila temoi, alikuwa na ameachwa in poverty. Amenda kusayi mm. dia. Aliachwa in poverty. Aliachwa, then alimuacha. Then what did he use to raise this child if he was poor? Let's be genuine in this conversation. Hey, madam, anafikiria kona zingine no. za, za mviringo. No, you know, okay. some, there's something, <laughs> some things in life that you cannot, you cannot Life run off. from. Hmm. Ana is a kwa mpua, mpua this time. Maybe he was rich and some occasions came and she, he became poor. Where is your life? So he became poor and domana. Um totally more abandoned. Every day he prayed. Oh, my, my son, I raised him. I rudi kwa biological father. Kwanza mostly these guys, our my boy, kwanza urudi kutafuta mababa. Mababa wao, biological. I'd, I'd like to... Oh, I'm not rude. Kutafita baba, baba. Wow. I'd like to imagine you are quite individual. And when you to come to a legionnaire, I'm rude. And also, I yeah. studied I studied human behavior as part of my bachelor's. Mm -hmm. And if this child went back to look for his biological father, mm -hmm. that shows there is something that was missing between mm -hmm. this. Uh, uyu baba ke mlezi mm -hmm. hakuwa nampatia. There is some expectation he grew up with, or maybe somebody mentioned to him that this is not your biological father and that kept on growing in his mind to a point he was like if i get myself together i will look for my dad mm -hmm. and i'll show him the love that i should give this person who don't appreciate me mm -hmm. as a son there is a lot of factors that pull that together mm -hmm. for some a child to one day wake up and maybe abandon as you want to put it want to abandon mm -hmm. the baba mlezi mm -hmm. to go for baba mzazi they are Many other factors. Aya, na, nataka to to shikileyo vain ya expectation. Alafu ni ulize, do single moms have more expectations than ladies who are not single moms? So, for example, if uh, ulikona date young who, who does not have a child, shida ke maybe takuwa ni nyuele, o mtumie fea, nini wapi, but the single mom, you know, has real life situations. She needs to find food for her child and, and all these things. Do you, do you think, I'm not doing this out of malice. It's just a, a, a question that mm -hmm. I am posing to my people. Okay. Yeah. okay. If you're going to date a single woman, mm -hmm. she doesn't need your money. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm quite used to raising her kids in your own way. My coffee, Ati. <laughs> She's used to raising her family. Hey. I'm a to survive without you. Mm -hmm. She can do without you. Mm -hmm. So the best thing you can give to a single lady if you love her is your time. That's the best. I like that. You can surprise her with the gifts. Pesa, mm unaiza, -hmm. but she, she has money. Mm -hmm. I'm a survival bill and mm -hmm. she's used to it. Mm -hmm. So you can surprise her with gifts, but the best thing you can give her is your time. What do you think? Do you think wana kuja sana, wana At one means? point I agree with him. Mm -hmm. At one point I disagree. Tell me why you disagree. He's talking of her. Uh, amekuwa akijisimamia ya mwenye. Mm -hmm. Probably, aliatwa. Mm -hmm. Aliatwa na mtoto. Mm -hmm. Now the society expect that juu meatwa prove us that you can make it without, without, without this man. Mm -hmm. So, ili ya potensi yote ya yoke ya nyanaeka, see it because she wants to. Mm -hmm. Ata kukulutu the society and this man mwenye aliacha, actually, ulikuwa 2-1% of my life. I can't make it without it. So, see it here, I'm, I, I, anajaribu kureis, mm. like, from Dani. Mm -hmm. Nile, nile shinikizo ya, you are a single mother, show us how you can make it alone. So in a way, mm -hmm. like, I want to. Mm -hmm. So the fact of, anaitaji pesa, my friend. Mwanamuge hezi kapi pesa. Siku sema, anaitaji pesa. 
I didn't say I take pesa. I said pesa is not the core thing in the relationship apo because I'm as well kusave bila wewe. But she needs money, she needs your support and money is part of your support to the lady. So money nine ni compulsory although ni mesema si a must. You are not going to the relationship because the lady needs your money. She, she doesn't she does, need she's it. She's not sitting waiting yeah. for a bank. Hey. She's looking for a partner. If okay, you think uh, you're right. I want to first agree with the gentleman, but uh -huh. his school of thought is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> first, uh -huh. everybody uh -huh. have a purpose for life, mm -hmm. whether you are a single, you are a mom, mm -hmm. or you are not. Mm -hmm. There is a reason for you to wake up every day. Mm -hmm. There is nothing we want to prove to people mm -hmm. for taking care of our children. Mm -hmm. It's just living normal life, mm -hmm. chasing your dreams. Mm -hmm. I am in school. I'm taking care of my daughter. What am I trying to prove to society? Mm -hmm. And society now will mm -hmm. come and tell you, Sasa we una ringa, una kam sana. Just because you think you have a child. And so now you don't need a man. You've been empowered way too much. Suddenly. Uh, that, that I don't completely uh, agree with that. Mm -hmm. Everybody since you were born, mm -hmm. you had a purpose to live. Mm -hmm. That's why you went to school. That's why he's in the university. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm schooling. Mm -hmm. If at all I wanted to prove the society I can survive without a man, I could be a billionaire businesswoman somewhere mm -hmm. and not schooling. Mm -hmm. So th that is quite crazy that we are trying to prove up. We don't, women don't try to prove points by taking care of their children. It's not proving anything. The fact that we took responsibility of bringing these children to the world mm -hmm. and making sure they had something to put in their mouth doesn't mean that we, we are trying to prove something for the responsibility mm -hmm. of that person who got this woman pregnant. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. That's immature. That's naive. Let's wake up, man. I like that you know what you want. And I can assure you, because there are guys who like ladies who don't know what they want so that they can take them and many girls have been taken advantage of it's look true. at these young moms who are taking care of three four girl children mm -hmm. for example and they are still single mm -hmm. what's happened I, i'm speaking from experience mm -hmm. i in my line of duty mm -hmm. in Warsaw, mm -hmm. i have interacted with many moms mm -hmm. even in the society mm -hmm. i've interacted with young moms and most of the, the, their first children mm -hmm. Possibly people will say it was a mistake. Mm -hmm. And these young women are very vulnerable. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they even lose hope and they're looking for somebody to give them hope. Mm -hmm. And they stand victims to small lies from men. Mm -hmm. Another man will come and lie to them. Mm -hmm. You know what? I love you. I want to take you in with your child and mm -hmm. all that. And they give in to this guy. The moment they get pregnant, again, it repeats. The person they runs away, oh. tells him, I can't. I didn't want a child. Well, so they end up, she ends up with a second child, mm. another burden, another responsibility on her. So it's kind of, it's also time for young girls to wake up. Being a single mom is mm -hmm. not being desperate. If at all God gave you a gift of a child, don't look for other gifts. Tafadali, stick to that one. <laughs> <laughs> Accomplish your dreams first. <laughs> we'll start at a meeting after this. And your chair lady. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. All right. So let us uh, read from our party people at Y254 on Facebook at Y254 channel under the hashtag. Is what in the morning on my question Monday. The question is, would you date a single mom, Kings? Would you? We have a Andrew Gitimo. Ah! Ha, where we the sasa okay. Where we where Unona Kenya Mandy Kaba ni mimi tuni me jedit kwa macho. Unona ke andro mesema. <laughs> okay, innocent Kinaya. Expect rejection because all she will have for you is all men are dogs. Okay, but na skia mwenzangu wapa alikuwa na date at some point. Okay, we have George Flex, car single, bado pia utajwa. <laughs> Prince Anthony says Kayole Sote locked. Misifa Berbatov says 22 oh, they're locked. I see Jasper Nyambati. They are a no go zone. Siwezi Rudia Tena. I had one karibu anitoe matumbo. What did you do? Hi Lindsley. Misifa, I see you. First of all, I think most men will be hit and run because qua ground we have our own baby mamas. Hey! So in short, Hakuna ku kufia hapo kama ni kuku fear uko na dem na ako na mtoi already so wako same wow okay all right edgar hansel mamoroti says from mercy to and say last thing penda reggae love ni love apana tambua alex maluti says i have one i still think whether she can fit gb africa says wanaume wacheni 
Well, mm, most here will flee. <laughs> At most guys take flight once they know she's a single mom. Lokeno Joseph, if you want to know a real character, a single mom just beat her kids. <coughs> At <laughs> Wait, he advised me not to say anything. I'm coming to Cherry Faith says, "Love them all." Jay Abdul says, "Look the other direction and run." Linti Music says, "Everything is to try." Labda utakufia dem hanam toto kumbendo shida. So ina tegemea na maumbile amtu. Kevin Midi goes a single mom. Love again. Amara Tamar says, "The best decision you can ever make." Where RuPaul says, "Good morning." Watching Dame H Town, pure commitment and love galore. Prince Pius differences. If at all it's it's real, he'll come kufia. Then go for her. Don't let your heart be in pain because of her child. Sometimes you never know your blessing lies. True love doesn't have limits. I believe if anything is meant to be, then it definitely must happen. Hmm. You're so deep, sir. We have a Jane Gashia. Love is blind. Love her the way she is. Watching from Kakamega. Nix Nix says, single mom loving again. Sheikh Idris Damba, the best relationship and advice. Louis Morio says, the issue is not whether she's single or not. The baseline is that I'm in love with her and vice versa. Who knows whether the kids or kid could be Kipchoge of tomorrow. <laughs> well, way we do say now, if you... Huh. But I get you, I see you, I hear you, and I definitely feel you. At Twite 5 on Facebook, at Twite 254 channel on Twitter, hashtag is why in the morning. Okay, so our next slide happens to be, what happens? Okay, can I, can I, talk to me. Can I just uh, mm -hmm. it, uh, react to one of the comments mm -hmm. you read? Look at the other side and run. Kwanza mm umungina -hmm. just... Uh, I'm trying to ask the person who wrote that and maybe uh -huh. the supporters of that comment. If I, I suppose you're raised by both parents, if your dad looked at the other side and ran uh -huh. and left you with your mom, mm -hmm. would you still be speaking the same way? Let's be honest, let's mm -hmm. be genuine. Stop stereotyping young moms, single well, moms in specific. Mm -hmm. He asks that if the man mm -hmm. left the child and ran away in the other direction. Mm -hmm. Now I have a question on you. If you are not pregnant. Would you, would you be on the same direction as now? If I was not pregnant, I would if, still if be chasing my dreams. On, on single mothers or my shako pre and Whatever the case, at some age I need a child. But that is after umejipanga, umeona, umeanza maisha, then let me ask you, young man, do you have sex? <laughs> well, 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 ref, ref, and at a time, thank you so very much for watching the show. Jamani uku, uku, kume waka, moro. I told you with the hardest breakfast show around. Kama uniamini, kana mama yako. At 254 on Facebook, at 254 channel on Twitter, hashtag is what in the morning. We have been blessed to have you. We will have a repeat that is from tomorrow onwards to Friday. Keshoni Entrepreneur Tuesday. You don't want to miss it. Thank you. Have a great day. We wave, guys.